School students will be moved to a new high school once construction wraps up on the new school uh, opens. Tonight, CMS is holding a meeting to address parents' concerns over a rough draft and new boundary maps that were just released. Queen City News anchor Robin Kennedy joins us now live in the Thornhill neighborhood in Ballantyne. And Robin, that is just one of many neighborhoods that are going to be impacted by these new school zones. That's right, Brian. Right now, I am standing in a neighborhood that is currently zoned for Audrey Cal High School, but that is set to change. And if you're watching this and you think I'm not a student or a parent, so this really doesn't affect me, don't be so sure. South Charlotte and Ballantyne are a home buyer's dream, and not just because of the homes. They are moving here for a lot of those schools, Audrey Kell, Myers Park, South Mech. Schools were a big factor when Karen Morris bought her Ballantyne home years ago. That definitely was a consideration. Now, she and her daughter are going to have to make another decision, where her daughter will spend her senior year of high school. A new school is being built and Karen's daughter is slated to be rezoned to attend that school. But according to Charlotte Mecklenburg School's current guidance, seniors only will have a choice to stay at their current school or move to the new school when it's set to open in the fall of 2024. Her main concern would be that she would be with her peers. According to the first draft of the new boundary map, the communities that will be rezoned to go to the new high school off North Community House Road are Lake Wiley, Pineville, Ballantyne, White Oak, and McAlpine. Currently, those homes are right now are zoned for award-winning schools. U.S. News and World Report ranks Audrey Kell 10th in North Carolina, Myers Park 52nd, and South Mech 68th, based off of factors including performance on state-required tests, graduation, and how well schools prepare students for college. But a change in school boundaries could mean uncertainty with the real estate market. Right now, those homes are zoned for really hot school districts, and it, it just becomes a big unknown. But change is sometimes necessary. Audrey Cal is a wonderful school, but it is, it's large and it's growing every year. So I'm really pleased to hear that they are building a new school. Now, that community meeting is tonight at 630 at Myers Park, uh, rather it's at South Mech High School, South Mech High School at 630 tonight. And that's where they're going to be talking about the new boundary maps for that new CMS high school. And our Daniel Pierce is there. He is going to have a full report for you tonight on Queen City News at 10. I'm live in Valentine, Robin Kennedy, Queen City News.